Hello, it's Mark Matosh, Chief Mark on 3D, and today we're going to be talking about the Discombobulator add-on. I was looking through the list of add-ons that had come with Blender. <laughs> it's Discombobulator. So, let's have a look at it. So, I've enabled it, and I've got this mesh set up. We can see that it's pretty evenly distributed. I'm going to press spacebar and type in Discombobulator. So, let's bring this up. So, this brings up our side menu here. Um, from here, we can see, we can change the maximum height that, um, actually, let's just press OK. What do we get? And so this is what we get. We get kind of like sci-fi panels. So almost, it's almost like the Greebles and plating add-on um, that I showcased or uh, did a review on a couple of weeks ago. So it kind of goes off that. So let's just go back and let's just get rid of these. Go away, skedaddle. And let's go back into edit mode, discombobulator. And so we've got a whole bunch of add-on, a um, whole bunch of options here. We can set our heights, minimum taper, maximum taper. Hmm. Maximum taper, 90%. Let's go, okay, 0 0.8, 0 0.8, 0 0.9. And let's see if we can get some really good sharp angles coming out of this. And let's press OK and let's see what happens. So those triangles have become much more flatter, which we don't want. We want to go harsher. So let's try that again. Delete, let delete, select this, go back into edit mode, discombobulate, 0 0.05, 0 0.1. Dun, 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 dun. And let's bring these down. So what this uh, the doodads are is per box, how many doodads will pop out. Oh boy. Um, so we've got a set of maximum one. So that whole plate there will be one piece or it could be split up into four. So let's press OK on that one. And there we have it. The Discombobulator mod. So this comes free with Blender. Please make sure you like and subscribe to the video. It really helps me out and keeps the channel growing.